Hi everyone, Paul Levy with Brownells here and this week we have some more new products. First up, from Aero Precision, we have another OEM rifle. This one happens to be in 6.5 Creedmoor. So if you've been looking for a rifle in that chambering, this is a good setup. All you have to do is add on your favorite handguard and your favorite fixed buttstock. Comes with this rifle length tube already installed. They've got a nice matte stainless steel barrel all ready to go, set up with your gas block, ready to fire. That's new from Aero Precision. And next up, from GSG, we have their MP40. This is actually in 9mm, it's not a 22 uh, clone, and it's got some pretty neat features that are very similar to the originals. Uh, it does take a proprietary magazine, much like the original MP40 double stack, feeds into a single stack. Uh, magazine release is right where the original was. Uh, it is a closed bolt, it's a new production semi-auto, uh, but it does have the bolt hold open feature like you saw on those. Uh, where the traditional takedown uh, button would be. Uh, this is now where the safety is. So there's safe, uh, there's fire. Uh, a few other features, it's got a flip up rear sight. You can change uh, the rear notch size. Uh, and then the front has a white dot. Uh, one nice big feature is the threaded muzzle. Has this cap like an original MP40 or an AK, most people are probably more familiar with. And that's threaded half 28, so you can throw your favorite suppressor on this. Would be a great SBR host down the road. That's new from GSG. And next up, from Anderson Manufacturing, we have a stripped AR-15 upper receiver, but it's not a standard uh, strip receiver. You'll notice right here, this is hogged out just a little bit extra. This is for your big bore stuff, 458 SOCOM specifically. Um, so you can use that with a big bore. You don't have to worry about the brass catching on the ejection port. You don't have to do the machining yourself to get that clear. Works with the standard ejection port cover. All the other parts are compatible with standard components. That's new from Anderson. And next up from XLR Industries, we have their adjustable butt stocks. Uh, these have been pretty popular in three gun and competition for a while. They'll also work fine on say chassis guns for bolts, uh, bolt guns. Um, it's adjustable in a few different ways. You've got your cheek piece right here, which has this nice padded covering on it. You probably can't really tell on camera, but this is padded right here. Um, so you can adjust that vertically. You can adjust it front to back. Everything does slide on this AR-15 style tube, so you can move this uh, entire assembly uh, forward or towards the rear. Um, and then on the back, you have an adjustable butt plate. You can move this um, vertically as well. Pretty nice, that's new from XLR Industries. And next up, from MGW, we have what looks like their very popular Pro Sight Mover tool. This is the Range Master. Uh, the main difference between this and the Pro is it is shorter overall. So they reduce cost basically by removing material um, and overall machine time. So this comes in at a great price point, $200. Maybe a bit more affordable for that guy that isn't gonna be working on a bunch of different guns. Uh, the nice thing is it takes the standard shoes that the Pro does so you can go out buy shoes that are already out there um, and other standard components. So great pickup, um, nice if you only have say two, three guns, you're gonna be swapping sights on, not doing a whole lot. Also great to take to the range, hence Range Master. You can adjust your sights on the range on the fly very precisely. That's new from MGW. And while we're talking sights, we have Trigicom's new HD XR front sights. Now we've had these sight sets available for a little while, now, say if you just want the front sight, you can pick this up. Uh, the nice thing about these, they got the HD uh, luminescent uh, front with the uh, tritium center, but they're a bit thinner than the standard HDs. A lot of guys just don't like that wide front sight. These are just a hair thinner, uh, gives you a, a nice sight picture. That's new from Trigicon. That's it for this week. I'll see you again next week.